YouTube channel. Today we're at Yuba State Park here in Utah. It's pretty big, you guys can see. Let's see, I'm gonna get a better shot. But we're just here with our, these blow up things. And we're gonna go on the and shoot a lot of fun together. So, it should be great for we get a video. Please give it a thumbs up, subscribe below, and let's go party. Just relaxing. Just floating along. Do, 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 do. Wait, stop back. I need to go forward more. All right. When you're walking, when you're walking, you're blow up animals. Good boy, you guys. You're neglecting my unicorn. All right, so we're doing the which french fries are better and the fast food water, which one's better? Challenges. <laughs> so we're gonna get both at the same time. You should just mapping them out and they should be really good. I'm excited, I've been wanting to try both of these, especially the water one for forever. Because <laughs> I, I drink water, you guys. I don't drink anything else besides juice. So hopefully this is good, because I saw it before, the water challenge when Blimmy counted it, so I'm really excited to be trying this out. Hi, can I just get a small water? No, nope, that's all. <laughs> yep, that was in love with an Englishman. Can you throw it on the neck and then let it go by the hand? Maybe I just want to be. Not gonna do it. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. He didn't get to that. Oh, you guys. The car smells really bad at French fries. I think it smells bad. And I don't eat much junk food at all. This is gonna be. This will be a. Interesting challenge. Chase is loving it. I get to eat all the french fries. So. Yeah, after I take a bite or two. That's really what this is. This is called, I take a bite of french fries, you get all the free french fries you like. Mm -hmm. I'm okay with that. That's my car today. It is, I'm just stuck my foot on it. So. Yeah, thanks, Sarah. Oh, Shira. You guys, I'm freaking out. Big time, you guys know, I talk about Paving Canyon. I'll post all the vlogs somewhere around here. I've been talking a lot about Paving Canyon. It's my favorite place here ever to go. It's where I just love to go hang out. But they finally opened it like all the way up. There's like a little section, but I don't really go up to that part of the section um, at all. So I'm super excited to go see this. I'm gonna show you guys some of the things. And really excited to go see where I go camping a lot because um, it's been shut down and I have not seen it since. Um, I haven't seen it since the fires. So I'm super excited to go see this. I'm gonna bring you guys along and just have a great afternoon coming up here. So keep following because I'm so pumped. The gate is open and we are past. I never thought, well, okay, I did think. I just didn't think it'd be this soon. Cause lately it's been seeming like it may never. Oh my goodness, look at that. There used to be fences there, all the trees. Wow. Oh wow, look at this damage. Now this is crazy. This is weird. So, like I've, I've seen the damage and I showed these the images I've seen before on a separate hike. But this is just 
Oh, it's gonna be so dead in here. It's always been pretty just to come up through here. Family's camping spot is safe. Yeah, what did you guys in the spot? So we cut for all the time and it's still green around here. So nice. I'm really, really excited to be up here. It's so pretty. And it's like a perfect day. Really, this is this just makes me so so happy! This is my special spot up here. And there's been so many memories and I just grown up up here so pretty to be like God, it's, it, it, I'm so I'm, I'm just thrilled and I have no words. And all my words are just the same words over and over again because I guess. So I'm gonna enjoy this. I'm probably gonna set up a hammock I haven't never used my hammock and I'm pretty sure it's in my car hopefully still. And just relax. So yeah, so I this awesome scar or this awesome little swelling mark I got from hitting a branch. I'm just special, we know. But I'm up here at Payson Canyon, and it is quite burnt, so I'm gonna show you guys some clips. Look how sad. It's just like, gone. You can see here, it got so hot that the bark started splitting. It's kind of crazy and kind of a different look. It's also really sad that this happened. We'll be having a parade, there's a rodeo, and some other things going on. So I didn't realize this until about a year ago that other places don't have this, but in Utah we have city days, which is like every city will have a big celebration. So there's like parades, rodeos, fairs, and it's going on every summer. So I mean, every like weekend during the summer. So any city you can find is probably doing one of these that's going on. So I'm back down, kind of at my hometown. And go see the one huge. It's probably the biggest one I go to. I may go occasionally to other ones, but for sure this is one I can to. So I'm really excited. It's gonna be great. It just reminds me of my childhood. It makes me just feel like so happy. So we're gonna we're gonna enjoy this today. Yeah. 